Hi, I'm Isaiah Jackson. I've been training at the trench for five to six years. Hey, my name is Mason Arnold. I've been training at the Trench Academy for three years. My name is Hayden Reed, and I've been training here since the eighth grade. My name is Desmond Moody. I've been going to the trench since I was a freshman. My name is Gary Shepard, and I've been training at D1 for three years now. Hi, my name is Maggie Rowe. I've been training at the Trench Academy for about a year. Hey, I'm Justice Barber, and I've been working out at the Trench for about a year. I'm Emma Adcock, and I've been training at Trench for about a year. Hi, my name is Joseph Bryant. I've been training at the Trench for about a year. Hello, my name is Noah Kent. I have been training at the Trench Academy for two years now. I'm Austin Brannon. I've been at Trench for about 10 years, and I actually heard about it from my youth team. The whole team actually came up to D1, and I've been loving it ever since. I'd say Trench really changed me as a person in every way possible, from work ethic to even learning how to recover your body and just to be a good man. I've been here so long, I've seen so many great athletes come in. It's actually kind of taught me how to be a good athlete, and it's definitely prepared me to kill all the high school workouts, and I think it really helped me succeed in high school and throughout. So originally, I came to the trench because I've seen my teammates working out here, and you know, just coming here just made me get a better mindset of where I want to be and my goals. And seeing the NFL players coming here, just working out with them, picking their brain, really helped me really want to be, like, get towards my goals, actually. And trench has taught me that recovery is just as important as your workout. At the trench, I've been learning how to be motivated during my workouts and how to have the perfect form. And I would say the biggest thing that I have learned while being at trench is the fact that um, growth can only occur when it's laid on a foundation of discipline. Um, you got to be disciplined and committed to the work that you do day in and day out, and that's the only way that you're going you're gonna to see a physical impact on your body, a mental impact. Um, in all aspects of your life, not only on the field, but off the field as well. I think that one of my biggest things that I've learned and that I'll take going into college here is um, how to properly train and how to make sure all my form is correct while I'm training, um, along with just properly going through the recovery process as well. And the biggest thing that I've learned from here is that basically working hard every day pays off. And the biggest thing I learned is uh, my technique has gotten better and my form. Uh, it's taught me how to deal with adversity and um, be able to play at the next level. Uh, my whole piece of advice would be to trust the process and stay focused. And one thing that I've learned is to stay consistent and trust the process. If I had to teach one thing to younger trench athletes, the thing that I would want them to know is that adversity isn't final. Um, I've gone through four injuries during high school and I could have just taken a step back and said goodbye to football, but I also know that every single day I'm given an opportunity to continue and fight. One thing I've learned from Trench Academy is they've taught me how to push through workouts when they seem unbearable. This fall, I'll be taking my talents to Campbell University, and I'll be majoring in exercise science. In the fall, I'll be taking my talents to McPherson College to play defensive back, and I'll take the uh, leadership roles and the, um, the skills that I've got from the trench up there and then empower my teammates. I will be attending the United States Military Academy at West Point. I'm going to school at West Virginia Wesleyan and I will be majoring in sports business. This fall I'll be taking my talents to Morehouse where I'll be majoring in finance. I will be attending The Ohio State University in the fall and I will be majoring in business. This fall, I'll be attending Virginia Tech University, and I'll be majoring in business and finances. I'll be going to Center College in Danville, Kentucky, and majoring in business. And I'm attending West Virginia Wesleyan College, and I will be majoring in nursing. My piece of advice would be to always give your 100% and even 110%, because this will affect you later on, and with your recruiting or with how you perform later in a tournament or a game. One piece of advice I'd give to people looking at or trying to train at Trench would be to give it your all and to just trust the process and eventually you'll make it. Um, I think a biggest piece of advice that I would give somebody who is thinking about coming to train here would be to just 
get into it and give it your all while you're here. Um, some days might be tough, but the outcome will be better than what you can think it will ever be. My biggest advice would be that consistency is king and that if you just work hard at something every single day, you're going to get 1% better every single day. And at the end of the year, that's 365%, which is basically three times better. Um, biggest piece of advice I'd give them is uh, to keep working and work on your form and technique and uh, get all the little things before you try bigger weights and heavy weights. A piece of advice I can give to the other classmen is take no days off. One thing I would like to tell the young dogs or anybody starting out new here is to be consistent and trust the process. All right, now say my name is Mason Arnold. I'm signing off. My name is Mason Arnold. I'm signing off. <laughs> We're making a blooper reel. Absolutely. My name is Mason Arnold. I've been training at the Trench Academy for three years, and what the Trench Academy has taught me is how to conduct myself like a pro and how to work out like a pro. My name is Mason Arnold. I've been training at the Trench Academy for three years. I don't <laughs> oh. Dude, you're killing me. I'm killing you. Hey, 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 easy. Swinging. I don't even know about no swinging. It's, right it's confidence. Mm. I'm recording, by the way. So all this. Uh, bro, you're. Oh, this is the senior video. <laughs> what do you think I was doing? I don't know. Throwing on the ground. Nah, mm. it's gonna be at, at the bank. Where everyone's gonna be sitting there, and all they're gonna hear is Mason swinging. Like this. Mason Arnold swinging. No. You know what it is. Look at these veins, man. Come on, let me know. Guy. So, my, right. my name is Mason Arnold. I've been at the Trench Academy for three years, and they have taught me how to conduct myself like a professional, how to push through a workout when you don't want to, how to work hard, how to work. No! What's the I forgot what I was going to say, bro. I forgot what I was going to say. What? Huh? What did you say? Hey, cast note. Yeah, right here. All right, some of the things I've learned. So, what's your name? My name is Justice Barber. Hello. Hello. I have to say hello. Oh, shoot. What's good? My name is Jake Bissell. Okay. Hey, my name is Justice Barber. My name is Justice Barber. And I've been training at Oh. <laughs> hey, I'm Justice Barber and I've been working out at the trench for about a year. With who? And you learned <laughs> what from the trench? <laughs> You didn't. Oh, <laughs> you are that. adding said, things after things after that. things. All right, well, tell me about Coach Dina. Oh, what a great. <laughs> hey, guys. <laughs> 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 right. Man, tell me about Coach Dina. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? Me You're making me nervous. <laughs> okay. No, tank tops make my arms look fat. <laughs> okay, so. <clears throat> tell me about Coach Dina. <laughs> Why does your face look like that? Because you, you train with her like on the weekly and now it's like, who? Where? How? I don't like describing people. It makes me really anxious. Okay, fine. <laughs> how would you say the environment um, it's great. I think I know most of the. Question, please. <laughs> God, please. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> you should just make a blooper reel of me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Venus would have snap at me. She has a class, and y'all are in. No, it's me. <laughs> 
Oh, why they come here? Yeah. Didn't I say that already? No. Oh. <laughs> I hate looking at myself. Oh, I bet you have no mirrors in the house. Then. Well, <laughs> I mean, I have like five mirrors in my room, but like. Okay, come on. <laughs> We're here. All right? You and me. We're here. Okay, what is the question? <laughs> what, what advice would you give somebody? I'm sorry, I have such short term memory. <laughs> okay. Hi, my name is Maggie Rowe. This fall, I will be attending. Oh, you understand? Like yeah, yeah. This fall, this fall, I will be attending Virginia Tech University. Something I would tell to the young, to the young bulls, or. Dude, I was so close. You good? Just sit down and finish it. Just sit down and finish it. Just, just sit down and finish it, bro. Two. Give it your all every day. Start with the question, Mason. <laughs> they always say something like this. All right, question, question. Question. One piece of advice I would give the younger class. One piece of advice I would give to the young guys or anybody starting new here is trust the process. <laughs> you got it. You did it. <laughs> you did it. What's up with the dramatic pause, bro? Just say it.